Hey guys, good morning. Let me turn this down, sorry. That's like some feel good music that I play. I was looking for music for uh, a project that I'm working on, so it was in the background. So good morning, you guys. It is day three of our self-care challenge. I am so excited to be here. You can see my beautiful child's artwork. It's Malik's artwork. Isn't it great? All right, you guys, so here we are. It is day three of our self-care challenge. I'm Maisha T, I'm your life and business synergist, and I help overwhelm entrepreneurs create more synergy in their life by creating systems and strategies to help them get their life together. So listen, let's go ahead and get into it. Today is day three, and the biggest challenge of the biggest um, roadblock of success and self-care, in my opinion, is social media. Why? Because if you grab your phone and you are on your phone and you are just all up in groups, which for some of us who are in business, we are in groups, but strategically, um, if you're just scrolling down your timeline, watching different Facebook lives, I can say that in, from my experience, I have spent at least, at least an hour on a social media platform and it has nothing to do with my business. I could have just gotten distracted in my day, picked up my phone and said, oh, what's going on on Facebook? And stayed on Facebook. So today for the part of the self-care challenge, I want you to take a self, I want you to take a social media break. Yes, it's gonna be hard and you can do it. But we do spend so many hours, as I just said, on social media, that it's one of the biggest distractors to success. I mean, seriously, I have, I have, had clients who I've had to put on a social media detox um, because it helped them trigger something in their brain to help them realize like, oh my gosh, in this 45 minutes, I'm just sitting here scrolling on Facebook. I could have written some sales copy. I could have planned out my social media for a week. Yes, you can do a social media in a week for, in, for 45 minutes, trust me, depending on how strategic your plan is. Um, there's just so much you can get done in that 45 minute time block that you spent on Facebook, especially if it's not like something strategically placed in your life to help you thrive in your business. So today I wanna to empower you for just one hour, take a social media break, no Facebook, no Snapchat, no Twitter, no Instagram, not responding to comments, like strategically just take time to just be away from your screen, okay? Um, and what you can do instead is just buckle down and journal. If you don't have a journal, just get a blank piece of paper. And what I want you to do is write down five things that you are grateful for. Because gratefulness will allow you to appreciate what you have in this current moment and hopes to pursue something that you want in the future, right? So I used the example earlier today that when I have a bill that comes in the mail, my old response would be, oh my God, that's all I need is another bill. Now my response is I use that good old Reiki Choku Ray symbol. If you're a Reiki healer, you know what that is. I throw that Choku Ray symbol on that bad boy and I say, you know what? I'm grateful that my increase is coming, so I'm going to pay this bill when it's due. I don't stress out about bills anymore because I have this new gratitude practice. And not that my days are perfect, but I do notice that the days that I practice gratitude are my strongest days and the days that I thrive in my business. So for you, this is a challenge. I want you to take one hour and not do any social media. There is an amazing app that'll help you track this. It's called Quality Time. It should be if you're on Android in the Google Play Store and it's also an iPhone app. Let me see if I can pull this up for you. And you know what, tomorrow I'll have a full tutorial and review on this app that I use. So as you can see my app usage so far in the day, it's 20 minutes, it's been one hour and 45 minutes, 20 minutes, 20 minutes of that, 20 minutes with that, it, it like really breaks down what I was doing. I was in Evernote, PayPal, Facebook, um, Google Hangouts and my email, right? So what this app lets me do is it lets me block off my phone for an hour. I can't do anything unless I really want to, besides make phone calls. So today, I challenge you to download this Quality Time app, take an hour away from social media, and then write down five things that you're grateful for. Because when you spend time in quiet reflection, you acknowledge your blessings and you're able to attract more of it, more of it or more of what you want in your life. 
So that's all I have for you. Thank you guys for tuning in for day three of the self-care challenge. Be sure to take your social media break. If you need support, leave your uh, name and information in the comments. And guess what? I will be sure to get back to you. Not too soon because I'm actually going to go take my social media break now. You guys have a great day. Bye.